I want to go to breaking news right now in Glendale, where arrests have been made. This after a very contentious debate over pride instruction at schools there and a school meeting uh, with the board tonight. And we understand the crowd obviously unruly with the arrest. Sandra Mitchell is there live as we understand a dispersal order has been issued. Sandy, what can you tell us? Micah, you're exactly right. There has now been violence just outside where the Glendale Unified School Board meeting is happening. Inside, they've been very civilized, but outside, you see this large gathering of Glendale police. We are told that at least one arrest has been made. There was a confrontation at Kenworth and Wilson here, just outside the Unified School Board meeting. Police coming over a loudspeaker, ordering the crowd to disperse, saying that this is an unlawful assembly and that they will not hesitate to use chemical agents against the crowd. So again, things are starting to calm down, but you can hear the police shouting those orders in the background. Again, we have two sides here. Uh, a lot of people from the LGBTQ plus community who are here in support of this curriculum that has been in effect in Glendale since 2019. On the other side, we have a lot of people waving American flags saying this should not be introduced to children at a young age. The very latest, at least one person has been arrested. Glendale police ordering the crowd to disperse, but people are really digging in here and refusing to go. We'll keep our eye on things and uh, bring you the very latest. Live in Glendale right now, I'm Sandra Mitchell. Share Micah. Back to you. All right, Sandra, thank you. We'll continue to monitor the situation there in Glendale. The Good evening, I'm Micah Ullman. We begin here at 6.30 with breaking news from Glendale where a, at least one arrest has been made outside a heated school board meeting where they are addressing LGBTQ instruction in the classrooms. Gil Levis over the scene in Sky 5. Gil. Micah, you're looking at the crowd here. This is the 200 block of North Jackson Street in Glendale at the... Uh, Glendale Unified School District office. You can see as I zoom in here, the Glendale Police Department has put up a barricade, that yellow spiral uh, object there that goes all the way across to the sidewalk, separating the two groups out here. This is all in regards to a school board meeting tonight for the uh, a curriculum that's being voted on for the uh, pride support. I can zoom in here and show you that the two opposition sides have been have been separated by that and also by the uh, law enforcement officials here on the scene here. At this point, like you said, at least one person that has been arrested, but at this point it looks like the police have it uh, somewhat sustained. I'm going to zoom in here and show you some movement here that people are moving away or towards that uh, coiled object there. But uh, again, at this point, it looks like they've uh, restored some of the peace here with that, uh, that coiled object that's separating the two groups. But again, a large response by Glendale PD out here. Uh, and the CHP also has been notified as, as to what's going on here. But again, you can see the response there, the uh, police helicopter overhead as well, and the uh, many squad units that have showed up here in response to what was happening uh, just a short time ago. That's the latest overhead up in Sky 5. I'll send it back to you in the studio. Now, Gil, we understand a dispersal order was issued a short time ago. Obviously, you see um, several dozen people with no intention of leaving. What's your understanding of the situation uh, as it relates to law enforcement uh, and, and what they'll tolerate going forward here? Well, at this point, if they've already given that uh, dispersal order, they're not going to they're not going to wait. They're going to ask for these people to leave. If they don't leave. They may use force. They may move in and use, uh, like Sandra was saying earlier in her report, they might use some sort of a chemical, maybe uh, whatever they have on hand to disperse the crowd. But again, you can see what they've done here with that coiled uh, barrier. That is coming to uh, be very handy for those officers. They had it set up. They ha it was coiled up in this uh, planter. And uh, once there was a problem, they started pulling that out and separating the group. So that's kept them apart. But now for the police, they're going to want the groups to disperse. And if they don't, they will definitely move in and make more arrests. All right. We'll be watching it. Gil Levis in Sky 5. Thank you.